Hey everyone, I'm Bianca Renee and you're watching Bianca Renee Today. And today I'm going to show you how to cover dark circles. And luckily for you, I have two of them. Now before you say that I'm just tired or I need more sleep, no. I was born with these. And to prove that to you, I actually have some baby photos here to share with you. And look at the dark circles, even in my baby pictures. I mean, I don't think my mom was thinking. She obviously should have brought some highlight or something for this photo shoot. And here's a picture of me straight out the womb. And as you can see, there's some dark circles all around my eyes. So obviously I wasn't tired in this photo because I just took a nap for nine months. <gasps> now there's nude photos of me online. Damn it. The things you try to avoid in life. All right, so let's get started. I look kind of crazy. I have makeup from like here up, but not from here down. So the first thing I'm gonna do to conceal these babies is put a little bit of primer so there's no creasing. I preferably like to use the NYX pore filler, but it wasn't until I pushed record that I realized I'm completely out of that. So I'm going to use the Maybelline Baby Skin. Still don't know how I feel about this on my whole face. I do like the texture more than the NYX one, but I don't know, I think I prefer the NYX. We'll see. So I'm just gonna use a little baby bit just like that. And I'm going to apply this under my eyes to get a nice smooth surface. And we'll fill in my pores while we're at it. So the next thing I'm going to use is the MAC Prep and Prime in the color Peach Luster. The first time I used this was in my last Get Ready With Me video for Valentine's Day, and I've officially added it to my daily routine. So I'm going to use this as my color corrector to cancel out the darkness underneath my eyes. So this is a little twist up, and I'm just going to apply this only on the dark circles. If you're not gonna use this, I should zoom in. There you go, now you can really see these dark circles. So maybe I'm just gonna do one eye so we really can compare. But when you apply this, you don't want to apply it like a highlight and go like a huge triangle and go out. We only want this to color correct. And if the rest of your skin isn't dark, then what are you correcting? Just like that, already you can see it is brightening up. So I like to just kind of mix it in with my finger or you can use a beauty blender, your choice. Just from step one, you could see that the color corrector has already made this a lot lighter than this side. So I'm gonna keep this side dark so we can compare each step. So I'm gonna add my foundation. This is my favorite one right now. This is the L'Oreal Paris Infallible Pro Matte 24 Hour Foundation. So I'm gonna apply a little bit to my damp beauty blender and I'm gonna pat that all on there. When applying to the rest of my face, I just like to use a flat kabuki brush and just do my whole face. So now look at that comparison. This is with color corrector and foundation already so much better. But I'm gonna take it another step further. Now I'm gonna get the MAC Studio Finish Concealer in the color NC42, and I'm gonna use this as my highlight. This is going to really brighten up your eyes. And I'm just going to pat that on there with a flat brush just like this. These dark circles didn't stand a chance. And then we're just going to blend this out. To set my highlight, I'm gonna use the Benai Luxury Powder in Banana, and I'm gonna use a regular Kabuki brush to blend this all in. Today I'm gonna to try the L'Oreal Infallible Pro Matte Powder, which is the same as the foundation, and I'm gonna use this to blend in and set the rest of my foundation. But to take things one step further, I then grabbed my NYX Contour and Highlight Palette, and I got the yellow color in here, and I'm gonna apply this over the highlight just to give some extra brightness. This step is totally optional. Voila! Here are my finished results. Those dark circles are gone. Now I look alive and awake. Now I'm not a makeup artist, I'm just a girl with really dark circles and knows how to conceal them. 
Now, if you like this video, you'll probably like my other videos too. So make sure you guys subscribe, give this video a thumbs up, and you can follow me on Instagram at Ms. Bianca Renee. I post new videos every Sunday, so I'll see you guys next week. Thanks for watching Bianca Renee today. Thank you.